Hi, welcome to another craft. And today I'm gonna to read a story about the wide mouth frog. And before that, I'm gonna show you how to make your own rocking frog. So it's really easy to make. You need some green construction paper, red, um, glue, scissors, a pencil to curl the tongue, and then if you have googly eyes, you can use those, or you can make your own eyes. So the first step is you wanna take a green piece of paper and trace a, a nice size circle. Um, I just traced it around the rim of something, so I got a nice circle. So once you get that, you're gonna fold it in half. And then you've got the frog's face. Okay, then you're going to take your scraps of green paper, you want two pieces, I'm going to cut out two circles for the back of the eyes. So let me cut two big circles. You can just cut them, they don't have to be perfect. And you're going to glue them to the back of the frog. So I'm going to take my glue stick glue here. This is going to be the frog's eyes. So we got one there. And you want to take your second one, put a little glue, and glue it on. Hopefully it sticks. Okay, then the, you see the eyes pop up. Then once you, what I used was googly eyes. Here's my two googly eyes. If you don't have googly eyes, you can just make your own eyes. You can cut them out out of paper, make them as silly or as big as you want, and there's the frog's eyes. The last step is his tongue. So what I did, you want a little piece of red paper, I would say about this size. This would be a good size if you want to make his tongue a little longer, you can, it's up to you. Then you're gonna take a pencil, because you wanna curl it. And you're just gonna wrap the red paper around the pencil, and you get a nice tongue. Then again, you're just gonna put a little glue on the back, and stick your tongue on. And that's it, and you've got your frog. That's your rocking frog. And that's it for today. And next I'm gonna read a story about the wide mouthed frog. Hi, and now I'd like to read the book, The Wide Mouthed Frog. It's written by Keith Faulkner, illustrated by Jonathan Lambert. And thank you to Penguin Books for allowing us to read this book to you today. So we have The Wide Mouthed Frog. It's a pop-up book. I'm a wide-mouthed frog, and I eat lies, said the wide-mouthed frog, shooting out his long, sticky tongue. Here's his tongue. As he hopped along, he met a blue-feathered bird. I'm a wide-mouthed frog, and I eat flies said the wide-mouthed frog. What do you eat, bird? I eat wiggly worms and slugs, replied the bird, snapping his pointy beak. His beak. Next, the wide-mouthed frog met a furry brown mouse. I'm a wide-mouthed frog and I eat flies said the wide mouth frog. What do you eat, mouse? I eat crunchy seeds and juicy berries, replied the mouse, wiggling her whiskers. <gasps> Ooh, the wide mouth frog was still catching flies when he saw a big green alligator. I'm the wide mouth frog and I eat flies, said the wide mouth frog. What do you eat, alligator? I eat delicious wide mouth frogs, replied the alligator, 
showing his sharp white teeth. Oh, the wide mouth frog stopped catching flies and gulped. Then he puckered his lips and made his mouth as small as possible. Ooh, you don't see many of them around, do you, he said. And he leaped into the pond with a splash. <laughs> and that is the end. I hope you enjoyed our book, and we'll see you next time.